June in Winter Park will likely look a bit differently this year. These rainbow colored banners that once hung from these poles these past two years to celebrate Pride Month will no longer fly. Not having the banners up this year, it, it's a hit. Yeah. You know, it hurt. Thor Falk, the president and founder of Winter Park Pride Project, first applied to fly the banners in 2021. City staff had no problem then approving them, but that changed this year when Falk went to reapply again. The banner program is very likely to change, and that's going to have an impact on whether or not you can fly banners. City commissioners met last Wednesday to discuss limiting its banner program to only city-sponsored or promoted events, or in rare cases, to promote a local historic, artistic, or educational nonprofit events. Longtime resident Bonnie Jackson will tell you this is a direct response to her wanting to fly a pro-life banner. It's a little yellow banner with a stick figure family, a traditional family, a boy and a girl and a pregnant mom and it just said choose life at the top, celebrate family at the bottom. She applied last summer to have it fly this June but she says the city never approved or rejected it. Now if the proposed policy change is approved as is, she wouldn't even be allowed to apply. They were more offended by my banner than they were with a pride banner. And to me, that is the opposite of inclusive. God forbid that somebody might think Winter Park is pro-family or pro-life, how, how horrible. I mean, that's crazy. For Falk, this will just mean having to find other ways to celebrate pride. It won't ruin us, I can tell you that. We will still be here. Uh, flags will still be flying in June. City commissioners are expected to make a final decision on these proposed changes at next Wednesday's meeting. We'll keep you updated. We're in downtown Winter Park. I'm Patrick Perez, Fox 35 News.